Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the next episode of the best star power glitches here inside of Brawl Stars. Once again, we have a handful of fun glitches for all of you guys in today's video. A lot of you guys have been leaving in the comments down below your suggestions on glitches you want to see as well. It's been helping a whole lot with this series, so make sure to keep that going. I would really, really appreciate that. But without any further ado, let's get into this. Here we go. So my friends, if you managed to watch the last episode of this series, you'll know that we lost a very powerful asset in our war against the stinking bot here inside of Brawl Stars that we all hate immensely. But in today's video, I think we found a very good substitute, so make sure to stay tuned for that. But first, we gotta get into our normal series here, and that is taking out the heist safe as fast as possible. I think we might have some star power glitches that will work really, really good against this. So let's check it out. Okay guys, so as you all know with this little sub-segment that we have going on within this series, we're trying to find whoever can take out the heist safe the fastest, and the fastest one right now is definitely Daryl with Ambush, which is Piper's first star power, but I've been asking for your guys' help on this one, like giving your best suggestions on brawlers that could go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Daryl, even though his is absolutely insane. I think his is going to be the reigning top, like, best one for all time, but I feel like with every, whenever we do these star power glitches, whenever I'm finding, like, new combinations and stuff like that, I'm always surprised with the stuff that is yet to be undiscovered with this series. Um, so it wouldn't surprise me if there was something better than Daryl's. So I was tipped off in the comments of last episode of this one, and that is 8-Bit's first star power on Pam, so we'll see what happens here. The bots managed to kill me earlier on. I'm keeping a calm mind so far in today's video, guys, but we'll see if that deteriorates. <laughs> okay, here we go. Ready? So we're only doing 939 damage each shot, so I believe Daryl took it out in four shots, but this is a really, really good one. We're at 24% on the high safe, definitely blitzing through the safe and freaking getting back at the bots, the bots, man. I hate them so much, but that wasn't bad. That was a pretty good one. Okay, guys, so the next one that we're gonna be trying out here is Crow with Gene's second star power. Now, if you don't know what Gene's second star power is, is if you have your super charged up, you get plus 300 damage for your basic attack. Now, the theory is with Crow is if you manage to land every single one of your super attacks, so, Number one, you're going to get that damage increase for each of your poison daggers for the three that you shoot off with your basic attack. But what I want to test out is if we get a damage increase on all the daggers with your super. As you all know, crow super is pretty dang scary when it comes to the DPS if you're right on top of the thing. So I'm curious. I think we should test it out. So let's wait for the bots to do their own thing. Don't you dare place down that tick head, Mr. Tick. I'm sick of these bots. He's a bot and a bot. He's a double bot. Okay, here we go. Let's see if this does anything crazy. You know what? First, we should test out the basic attack. So we're doing 2,000. Ooh, wow. Okay, that's not bad. That's pretty good. But I'm curious to see how much damage this is. Screw off. Okay, I'm seeing 3,000. Okay, nothing crazy. I thought we were on to something there, but it's always good to test out what the capabilities are with the star power glitches. Now, before you guys are wondering, I managed to check out Dynamite's second star power on Crow, which adds 1,000 damage for your super. And in theory, if you could get every single one of Crow's daggers that fly off for 1,000 damage each, that'd be insane amounts of damage, but it didn't work, so... As unfortunate. I think Daryl's still the reigning champion of this little sub segment. But again, make sure to leave in the comments down below anything you think can stand toe to toe with Daryl. I don't know. <laughs> okay, guys, so rolling into the next one, and this one was definitely something that I saw in the comments profusely. So many people asked me to do this one. It's with my boy Mortis with Colt's second star power, so it gives him extra range. Now, if you guys have been playing Brawl Stars for quite some time, you'll know how OP Mortis's dash distance was when it, he was in his prime in his early days, and this is the same exact distance or close to, but as you can see, his dash range is crazy. He's really able to cover a lot of distance. He has really, really crazy mobility here. Um, it reminds me, it makes me uh, nostalgic of how good Mortis was back in the day, how easy dribbling was in Brawl Ball, where you don't have to be fast with it. You can just pass it up, kick it to it. You know what? We should test that out. Okay, guys, so I want to try this out with dribbling in Brawl Ball here to see if it does anything. Now, I've done the star power on my channel before, but I've never tried it in Brawl Ball. How much easier is it to dribble the ball? So here we go. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> like, 
That is so, so easy. Oh, that is beautiful. Um, and the funny thing is, is if you think way back in the day, this isn't even in his prime. Um, back in the day in Brawl Ball, when, the, when Brawl Stars was still in beta, um, it didn't cost any ammo to kick the ball. So you could dribble three times with max ammo with Mortis, which is crazy. Um, but man, this one is one of my favorite star power glitches by far. Really, really cool one. You guys, I'm trying to keep my composure with these bots. Am I doing a good job? My deep hatred for them is still there. Don't get me wrong. I hate them. I hate their guts. I hate every single one of them. But I'm trying my best here. I'm trying to keep a nice, calm mind. <laughs> okay, guys. So since we're talking about Mortis, I think it's really good to feature this star power glitch because, honestly, I haven't done this yet here on the channel. I'm surprised I haven't. Um, so as you all know... Okay, guys, so we got 30 seconds to pull this off. Um, so what we're trying to do is using Dynamite's second star power on Mortis, our safe is dying. What I want to show you is how OP it is to use your super with Mortis's uh, super here. I hate bots. Every, like, even the way they move. Like, I hate the way... I just hate everything about them. I hate them. <laughs> I hate them. Okay, guys, so take two. We're at 700 HP. Let's use our super. Never mind. The bots are just ruining everything. They're ruining everything. I hate the bots so much. Guys, it's time for the main attraction of today's video. This star power glitch has gotten me more excited than uh, a star power glitch in a very, very long time. It's so secretive. It's really, really hard to find out. Bots, even the bots on my team, quit following me. Stop it. God, I hate the bots on the enemy team. I hate my own teammates. They suck. Um, but this is our next thing. This is the next thing to combat the bots on how OP this thing is. Now, it's a little bit of a setup, Star Power. It takes a little bit of time to display its full its full potential here. So, why don't we get our first attack? Oh, it was tipped off to you guys. You guys get it. We're using Honey Coat on Penny here. But it also works on other brawlers as well. So hopefully my bot teammates can defend against that. I'm going to set up a mortar up here. Unless uh, the bots see. Okay, they're not going to. Looks like my bot teammates did fine. So let's place a mortar up there. It's going to start chipping away. But we need to get another super here ASAP. Come here, Carl. You stupid bot. Do we have any other stupid bots here in the pro? Okay, hopefully you don't see my mortar. The bots are stupid, so they shouldn't. Don't touch that mortar. I swear to God. Don't. Carl, don't ruin my fun. Oh, I don't like what this Carl is doing. Stop it. Stop it. I will kill you. Stink. Okay, ready? Okay, this is full potential. Look at this. Two mortars. Oh, it's so OP. It's so broken. Oh, this has got to be by far one of my favorite star power glitches of all time. This is... Such a great one. Okay, guys, so this epic star power glitch doesn't just work on Penny. It also works on every single spawner brawler in the game. Um, and as you can see with Pam, let's let the Daryl damage us so you guys can see just how OP the healing is. Go ahead, shoot me. Okay, don't kill me, though. Don't kill me. Bot, have some mercy here, huh? Yeah, just be dumb. The bots, I'm going to go insane, I swear. I just want them to do a little bit of damage to me. That's all I need. Tick is perfect for this. There we go. We can just scoop up that damage, but here we go. Let's place down the turret so we get overlapping healing stations, and we get double the healing. Look at how fast that goes. Oh, that's insane. Double healing station. Colt, attack me. Hit me. Someone hit me. There we go. Give me that damage. Ooh, yeah. Okay, let's see how much this heals us up. Ready? Are we in it? <laughs> Dude, this star power glitch is freaking awesome. I love it so much. Okay, guys, so heading into our next one. Now, this one is kind of like a visual glitch that I really enjoy a lot. And that is uh, Coiled Snake on Rico. As you can see, once he charges it up, the end of his gun starts wigging out. Someone tipped me off in the comments of last episode once again for this one, but it's so freaking funny. <laughs> <laughs> and we get a nice zoom in on that one. It is so freaking goofy. Um, but another cool thing about Rico is just like how crazy OP his range is with the coiled snake. Like the difference is pretty uncanny. Let's see it charge up if no bots mess with me. 8-bit. 8-bit! You guys get the picture. I can't go into this battlefield anymore. The bots are freaking making me go insane 
We need to do something about these bots. They're getting too strong. Okay, guys, so the final glitch that we're going to be attempting in today's video, and once again, I'm surprised that I didn't try this one out yet in all of the Star Power Glitch episodes that we've done so far, um, but it's Hyper Bear on Penny. Um, now, all you guys know that Hyper Bear works on Jesse, and it's really, really cool. Again, one of my favorite ones. I featured it in our episode outlining my favorite Star Power Glitches. Um, just because it's so freaking OP. Um, but I'm curious to see what it's going to be like on Penny here. How fast does the mortar shoot? So we're going to be testing it out on our favorite map to test this. Oh! Whoa! Oh my god! That's insane! So let's try this one more time. You, oh my goodness. Dude, I'm at my wit's end with the bots. We gotta do something about this, guys. Okay, let's try this again while they're all preoccupied. I'm gonna make sure to set this up perfectly because I wanna see this in its full glory. I wanna see it just chip away. You know what? This is gonna work better on a different game mode. Let's do it. Dude, I swear, after doing all these episodes, I swear they're getting better. The bots are most definitely getting better. Okay, guys. So attempting this here, my teammate bots just as dumb. Do you see that Daryl roll in? Am I stupid? Am I crazy? Even the bot teammates. I hate them. <laughs> Let's just get this set up. Dang it. We had the perfect opportunity there because it's a tie. So let's try and go into the right lane here because it's going to work fantastic in Siege because it's not as much space. There's a lot uh, more space here so the bots won't recognize the mortar. But here we go. Let's see what it does. Okay. Oh. My God. That is insane. Kill the tick. Kill the tick. No! Dude, the bots, I swear, ruin everything. They ruin all my fun. It doesn't matter what it is. They just, they live to ruin my fun. Tick, just attack the IKE. Don't worry about me. Tara, just go along your business. Just do your thing. <laughs> okay, I just want to see this again. Oh my gosh, that's so good. All right. Let's win this game. Screw the freaking bots. Let me win this game in peace. Bye-bye. Get owned. I hate you. <laughs> Man, that was a really, really good one. Again, I'm really surprised I didn't test that one out before. Hyper Bear on Penny is probably even more, like, visually appealing um, compared to Jesse with Hyper Bear. I'm not sure, though. What do you guys think? Which one do you like better? But that's the end of our next episode of the best star power glitches here inside of Brawl Stars. Hopefully, you guys all enjoyed it. Once again, all your comments really, really help with this series. Leaving suggestions. I swear there's always hidden star power glitches inside of this game that I still don't know about. And I test them almost like every day if not like every other day trying to find like cool combinations for the next series um so if you guys want to do that it would be really really helpful so if you guys did enjoy the episode make sure to slap a like on it really appreciate that with that being said make sure to keep having fun brawl stars and we'll see you in the next episode see ya